Hey everyone, how's everyone doing today? I hope all is well. So this is a very, very different video from me. I thought this would be a good idea to do because as you guys know, we are a family of seven, but the husband is deployed. But um, so right now we're just a family of six. Say hi, Mason. Hi. <laughs> okay, so you guys, we're a family of six right now. Kids have been home, you know, um, homeschooling, you know, the virtual learning that is going in effect that has been going on in effect for us here in Virginia. It's been, I think we're about three weeks in. We started very, very quickly um, on our learning. Thankfully, Virginia, Virginia Beach, I would say area has it together. We're kind of used to, I would say, um, disasters and natural disasters type of thing so yeah but anyway that's not what that's about I want to show you guys for a family of sex I go shopping every two weeks I go to Sam's Club I go to Walmart and sometimes I go to Aldi so I'll go to those three different stores so today I took it upon myself and I was like you know what payday is tomorrow I'm gonna go a day early and see if I can go first thing in the morning to Sam's Club, see if I can get toilet paper, paper towels, because I haven't had paper towels in like forever, and start grocery shopping just a day early. So I'm gonna take you guys over there. I only went to Sam's Club so far. And a few you're gonna see after Sam's Club's haul, you're gonna see the next haul, which is attached to all my grocery shopping, which probably be Walmart. All right, you guys, let's go on over there. Okay, so you guys, I do need to let you guys know this. Our lights went out, so we are in and an, we're going through a really nasty rain and winds. Trees have been falling down outside. So this is like real life, okay? You can't get any real than this. Okay, so say hi, Roxy. Okay, so as you can see over there, I have, I love my Scott's tissue. That is what we use all the time. The bath tissue was just back up. I am a prepper, so whenever I can get extra, I will. Um, don't come for me because guess what? That's just what I like to do, my husband and I. And if you don't like it, move on to the next um, video because that's just what it is. No, I'm not a heart hoarder. I'm a prepper. So anyway, um, I have um, our, what is it called? Our ugh, <laughs> styrofoam um, paper plates. Then we have our paper towels. Like I was saying, I haven't seen paper towels in like forever. All right, so we come right on over here. I have the loaves of bread. Normally, I buy about five loaves of bread every two weeks, but this is just four. There's two in a pack. Then I have, um, Mason, would you hold this for me? Come here. Okay. okay. Can you hold? Okay, you guys, I'm gonna have my son hold this. I want you to hold this in. No, 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 no. Come here. What are you doing? Yes. Hold this right here in this direction while I'm showing everybody. All right. So I bought two packs of tortillas because I plan on doing um, um, breakfast, making 24 breakfast burritos for the kids. This is the sausage that I'm going to go ahead and add on to that. I got this 10 pound bag of chicken wings, which works out perfectly. Then back there, sour cream. I never buy my sour cream like in the big, big tub. Yo, you're you're not helping me out. Okay. Um, I never buy my sour cream in a big tub. Go ahead, Mason, you can go. I never buy it in the big tub. I always buy them in the smaller quantities, but I have a few meals that I need. I, I mean, it's required that I have um, sour cream. And my kids love cheese sticks by Sargento. I only got one pack of ground beef, which is like the double pack because I have plenty in my freezer as of right now. My kids, they love their Takis. They got their Pop-Tarts. Yeah, 
um, I was able to find noodles. I haven't I haven't seen noodles in in a month probably. We haven't had any noodles on hand at all. So um, yeah, so I end up getting the big thing of it, obviously, because I was at Sam's. Ritz is a quick, quick little snack, cheese, crackers, whatever. Spaghetti sauce, we go through about three can, I mean three jars. We've got some some more chips right there. You guys, this is crazy angles. Um, my husband used to buy these all the time for the kids, the chicken quesadillas. Um, I they like them, so I decided to go ahead and pick them up again. I got some fruit back here. We got the pineapple, my favorite mangoes back there, the champagne mangoes, two things, a strawberries, which that brand right there is delicious. Their strawberries come out so sweet. And as you guys know, I have a garden in the back and I am growing strawberries. So hopefully I get some babies growing soon. Well, I do have some, but hopefully they're as sweet as this. Then um, I... Sorry, you guys. I gotta move this around. Um, I got two thing, two cartons of these eggs. Um, I was getting tired of buying beforehand. I was buying the twelve, well, the dozen, and then I went to the eighteen, and it just wasn't working for me anymore. Like it's just not enough. Eighteen is not enough for my family anymore. So. Yeah, we we went in on the eggs. Let me turn that around. Oh, you guys, I'm sorry. Anyway, I'm just not going to. And we have some Gatorade for the kids. So this is the Sam's Club shopping haul. And yeah, you guys, uh, <laughs> along with the power outage that we're experiencing right now. Lovely, huh? So... Anyway, you guys, um, keep watching and you will see what I get from Walmart next. All right, bye. Okay, you guys, so this is the second haul. This will be the final haul. All right, so I just got back from Walmart and as you can see, it's still dark in here. And we still have don't have any lights. We haven't had it since 11 o'clock. It's about to be two. Okay, so... Let's get a little closer. Um, obviously, since our lights are out, I think this would be great to have. Some extra flashlights. I bought three extra flashlights for the younger ones. Um, baby wipes. I was so glad that they actually had. They had like two packs of that left. Pull-ups. Kennedy's still in pull-ups. Extra batteries. It's always great to have. Tylenol. Adult and children. I definitely needed those. Um, freezer bags, um, cause I like to bag up my meats. I bag up everything. Um, freezer quarts, use them as sandwich bags a lot of the time, but yeah, I needed those cleaning products. We just needed some more of this, uh, Fabuloso, which we love so much. And look at that. It's already busted, but Beggars can't be choosers when it comes to the cleaning products. I mean, that's all we had. Um, that's all they basically had. Um, two things of powder donuts, which my younger ones love these ones. Um, needed more, um, needed more, what is that stuff called? Flour? I forgot what it was called. Scarlett's helping me with this light little situation, if you can see. She's holding some light. We got a sweet tea back there. This is one of our favorite sweet teas. Um, got a smaller thing of sugar. I really didn't need sugar, but um, lately we've been making cookies. So that, yeah. Uh, graham crackers. Normally I don't buy the whole gallon of almond milk like this. I normally buy them in the the carts like this but they didn't have any more so i had to opt out for that and that's the vanilla flavor this one is the unsweeted um unsweeted and it's the original this is what i cook with whenever anything calls for milk i use this that one um 
I got some brownie mix, which Scarlett is our baker in the house. She loves to bake. Um, straws, keep straws in the house. We've got some honey buns. These are my kids' favorite um, and mine and my husband's favorite fruit snacks. Um, how many count was this? This was the 32. They did have the 50, but I did not get that one. I had to be mindful on room that we have. We um and the the pistachio. Oh, I was gonna say pistachio. The spaghetti, not spaghetti. Oh my god, the pasta. Girl, I cannot. I can't talk. So the pasta, they did not have very much pasta. So I had to hog out for this one. It's okay. We'll live. Um, Texas toast. What else? Um, I will go on the other side. So I'll just start right here. Um, beef corn dogs. They only had one box of the beef left. So of course I grabbed it. Normally I buy two of those. We got the cheese. I got the five pound bag of cheese. Normally I do not do five pound. I do the two pound or the, is it three pound? But I have a lot of meals that I'm gonna be doing that's gonna require a lot of cheese. Then also this is their favorite lunch meat is the roast beef. Two taco season, oh, I just kinda of tossed that up there. Taco season packets. We got some barbecue sauce. My favorite green tea with the lemon. Absolutely needed that. Okay, um, I'm just going to start right here. Benjamin and I, and sometimes Scarlett, she'll eat these. We'll eat these. We Well, I love them. Benjamin loves them. Sometimes Scarlett will eat them, but it's the jalapenos. It's the pickled. We have some blue cheese, chunky blue cheese that is. Um, I just added this on. It's good to have some baked beans. Dang, that wind is howling outside. We have some olive oil, some garlic, and let's just make sure this is garlic. Garlic powder and onion. This one should be onion. Yeah, onion. Two more things of baby limas. We did not need this. This was not part of like the meals for the next two weeks, but I just wanted to grab them just in case. Um, obviously it's the day after um, Easter and everything's 50% off. So my kids love this one. Two um, things of garlic. I cook with a lot of garlic. Um, Lano Lakes, my favorite butter, needs a lot of that. Um, I got a smaller thing of this Jimmy Dean sausage. I did from Sam's Club, as you saw begin, um, in the beginning, it was a lot longer. It was the big, huge tube, but I got this one small just for maybe just a random day. I bought four of these crescents because I have a recipe that I definitely want to do with these. Um, if you guys are interested, thumbs this up, comment down below, say, hey, what what do you prepare for your kids now that they're home? This is kind of like this is kind of like summer for me. So anyway, um, then I bought, I thought I bought four cans of these um, Grand's Biscuit, the flakes, but I didn't. I thought I did, but I guess I didn't. I only got three and I, I'm, I have a recipe for this. It's going to be biscuits, sausage biscuits and gravy. And then the kids have been wanting to make s'mores. So we got some chocolate, some more marshmallows, which we already have marshmallows, but I just bought this great value brand, a smaller pack. Um, and I think I showed you guys the graham crackers were down there somewhere. Um, thing of cream cheese. I've got this one pound of bacon. Then I got the three pound of bacon, which they only had one of these left. I was like, oh no. So I was like, okay, um, I'll just buy one little one. And then I only have two things of vegetables, frozen vegetables, the mix and the peas. Now you guys are probably wondering, okay, a lot of junk. Where's the vegetables? Well, my vegetables are already taken care of. I have plenty of vegetables 
in my freezer that we're still working on. So that's why that's the lonely too. Okay, so we're gonna come around here on this side and a bunch of canned goods. I have um, can of celery, cream of celery, sorry. I have some chunky soup, which I have a couple cans of that, Rotel. We've got one can of the, what is this called? The chili for, you know, hot dogs or something like that or chili cheese dogs, whatever. Um, we got some cream of mushroom. I know I got cream of celery. I know I got cream of chicken. This is chili, um, chilies, chopped green chilies. What else did I get? That's chopped green chilies. Oh, wait, please. Um, what is this? Okay, I got some chili beans. I'm eating chili soon. There's cream of chicken. I got a bunch of canned goods. Um, this is the tomatoes right there. I hope I'm not giving you guys like a headache. Then I bought three things of the luncheon meat, which this is so crazy. Okay, it's called luncheon meat. This is just like spam. Spam, like for one can of spam. Huh? Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Um, one thing of Spam is like close to $3 a can. This, which is the exact same freaking ingredients because I compared the two. Um, and this is a dollar and some change. Like, come on now. It does not need to say Spam. So I got three of those. Then I got three of the tuna because I will be making tuna casserole. My kids can't wait for that. Got some more ketchup. Got two things of mustard. I'm a mustard head. Some of my other kids are too. I already showed you that. Um, oh, I was able to find spaghetti. Oh my God, the box is all wonky though. Oh well. Um, I was able to find spaghetti. It's the thin spaghetti, unfortunately, but that's all that I could find. And obviously one pack is nowhere near enough for my kids. And I, so I had to get two of those. I got some more Reynolds wrap. I know it's like, oh my God, I don't know what I was thinking, but I still have some more 75 foot left on my other one in the house. But what was I thinking? That is nothing. That is not going to do anything. And then um, some chicken broth, which this is the smaller thing of chicken broth. Normally I do a little bit bigger, but I still have some chicken broth laying around. Then this is Benjamin's favorite, which is, did I make sure I get the right one? Yeah, it's the chocolate chip um, chewy granola bars. Um, a few times I kept messing up and buying the variety pack. Huh? Okay, baby, I can't show you. You're changing your pull up. Okay, and so I think that is it, you guys. So, yes. I think I finished. I finished. So, all right. All right, you guys, totally forgot to show you this. I also picked up some glassware. Um, I'm trying to get out of where I'm um, using the tin, the metal plates, and I mean pans and stuff. So, this one was three in a pack, and I think this one was like 16 bucks. 14 to 16 bucks for this and this one was like three dollars and some change and it is um oven safe microwave freezer and dishwasher safe so yeah i cannot wait to throw out those metal ones because they are not looking good but to me it's just not safe so anyway I had to add that in all right you guys so for Sam's Club bill, I did spend a hundred, I mean, not a hundred, I wish. I spent $264.97 at Sam's Club. And then over at Walmart, I spent $294.40 there. And yeah, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day. Wait. Um, our electricity was out for over 24 hours. It's back on now, thank God. But this is this has been the biggest roller coaster ever. I've been through 
outage like this, power outage. I've been through stuff like this, but never to this extent where I went grocery shopping, putting groceries in my house and having to throw them out. Literally everything in my freezer was still frozen. Thank God of that. Well, everything in the refrigerator was very questionable. It was starting to get warm. It was just bad, you guys. Um, it, it Things just had gotten bad. And I luckily, a friend of mine, her father-in-law came over with his generator and hooked it up to, you know, my refrigerator to that. And I was able to, you know, have some power going. So that way, at least the freezer stuff stayed cold. So pretty much a lot of things in my refrigerator just I had a chuck. So I'm going to take you guys downstairs and show you guys the rest of the stuff that I had to repurchase because of this outage that we're going that we went through. And if you guys are in the Virginia area, Virginia Beach, I think it was just only Virginia Beach that experienced this. You guys know exactly what I'm ta I'm talking about. It came through and it came through very fast. And I didn't think it was going to be this bad because we've had blizzards before. We've had, you know, different outages before, but it's never been this long of a power outage. But like I said, we're up and going. Thank God of that. But I'm going to say goodbye here, but I am going to show you guys what I picked up. All right. Okay, you guys, sorry for the disorganization in my refrigerator. But this is the items that I had to repurchase. I had to repurchase all of these eggs. It was 40 eggs that I had to get rid of because they were feeling kind of lukewarm at the touch. Obviously, that was no good. I had to obviously get rid of the yogurt and I repurchased that. I got rid of all of this stuff, the, the biscuits, the crescent, uh, and I repurchased some more sour cream. I had to do that. Um, obviously cheese would be another one, the Sargento cheese. This was the smaller pack of bacon. Thank God it wasn't the big pack of bacon. I ended up putting that in the, the freezer. All this cheese we used. I had a five pound bag of cheese as you guys saw. I had to get rid of it. It was starting to get warm. It was ridiculous. So I had to repurchase the roast beef, the cheese. I ended up getting um, this thing of roast beef, trying this one out, see if the kids like it. Um, I did not repurchase strawberries. I kept the strawberries, kept the sweet tea. This is cookie dough that was in my freezer. I just pulled it out because I am going to make cookies soon. Well, no, Scarlett's going to make cookies soon. Um, and all of our almond milk, vanilla, and the one that I cook with, I had to repurchase. So those were the things that I had to repurchase. Oh, and also Roxy's. Oh, gosh, I didn't even show you guys this. I had to repurchase this big thing of um sausage did not see that and i had to repurchase roxy's um food as well but yes you guys that is an overall look right there and i hope you guys enjoy all right